Liquid limit. Liquid limit is the moisture content expressed as the percentage of the weight of a dry soil, at which the soil changes from a plastic to a liquid state. Separated by a groove of standard dimension, one centimeter deep, will join the length of one half inch under impact of 25 rows using the mechanical liquid limit or the Casagrande limits. The other brick limits are a basic measure of the critical water contents of fine daily soil. Depending on its water content, it can be solid, semi solid, plastic, and liquid. The boundary between each state can be defined based on the change in the soil's behavior. The Atterberg limits can be used to distinguish between silt and clay and to distinguish between different types of silt and clays. These limits were created by Albert Atterberg as we do are emotions. They were later defined by Arthur Casagrande. Distinctions in soil are used in assessing the soils that are to have structures in the Soils, when wet, retain water and some expanding volume. The amount of expansion is related to the ability of the soil to take in water and its structural makeup. To ensure that the soil will have the correct amount of shear strength and not too much change in volume as it expands and shrinks with the great moisture content. Thus, the, the determination of the limit is relevant in this subject. The apparatuses that we would be using in, in this experiment would be the evaporating dish, the spatula, the liquid limit device, the grooving tool, the containers, and the balance. Procedures Step 1 A sample weighing about 100 grams shall be taken from thoroughly mixed material passing the 0.425 mm seed which has been obtained in accordance with the standard procedures in preparation of disturbed soil sample for test. Put the sample on an evaporating dish. And based on our soil's water content, we would place 33 milliliters of water to 100 grams of soil. Stir the soil properly using the spatula. And remember, always mix the soil thoroughly. Place a portion of the paste in the brass cup of the liquid limit device. Level off the surface to the spatula to a maximum depth of 10 mm. Divide the soil path in, into segments with the means of the standard grooving tool. Mount the brush cup to the carriage such that it can be raised and allowed to drop sharply on the base through a height of 10 mm by rotating the crank at an approximate rate of 2 rotations per second until the closure of the groove about 30 mm from the bottom the closure should be by flow of the soil and not by slippage in the cup. Take a slice of approximately the width of the spatula extending from edge to edge of the soil cake at the right angles of the groove. Place the sample in a drying can for moisture content determination. Weigh the moisture can. And record the weight of the moisture can. 
weight the sample. And record the weight of the sample. Bring the sample to the oven to dry the sample. Put the sample in the oven and let it dry there overnight. Let the sample dry for overnight, take the sample out of the oven. After you have taken out the sample from the oven, weigh the dry sample and record the weight of the dry sample. 